uh, about nature and wildlife and environment and living, um, we have to actually uh, have an approach where we keep whatever is left now, whatever is gone is gone. So whatever is left, we should keep for the next generation. Our generation has actually, you know, not done a good job of, uh, you know, maintaining this earth. We have overloaded it. And actually the reason, according to me, one is consumerism. We buy whatever we buy because, not because we need it, because it is there in the market. So the moment you become conscious of whether I need something or not, and then go ahead and buy. So that will reduce a lot of pressure on planet Earth. So think before you buy anything. And uh, don't uh, keep like uh, cameras or cell phones, just don't keep up upgrading for the sake of upgrading. Really think whether you need it. That is one thing. Second thing is uh, the, the bane or the curse of mankind today, humankind today, is plastic. Try and avoid uh, buying anything that has to do with plastic because once um, you buy it, it, it will remain for there for the rest of, I don't know how many years, centuries maybe. Because till today, whatever plastic has been manufactured is still there. It has not disappeared. So imagine the kind of pressure that is there on forests, on oceans. In fact, yesterday we went to a beautiful place. It is called Ladam Road. It is very picturesque, but the kind of litter, because people don't know how to dispose of um, uh, whatever they have bought. So whether it is biscuit packets or, you know, whatever it is, chips or whatever, or, um, uh, you know, anything that you buy in uh, packaging form. So try and avoid uh, unnecessary purchase and definitely plastic avoid. See, there is a beautiful word in Sanskrit for planet Earth. It is called Vasudha. Vasudha means she who has plenty to offer everybody. So nature has enough and more to give all of us. The problem is in our greed. Gandhi said it very beautifully. He said there is enough on this earth for every man's need but not for every man's greed. So try and live with minimum. Uh, can, can I live with uh, uh, without something? If you can, try and live without that. So be very conscious of how much you are acquiring. Otherwise, there is no end to possessing things. You keep on you know, buying more and more and uh, possessing more and more. But do you really need it? Because everything that you consume puts a load on the earth. So think. Uh, one advice I have uh, for the next generation is uh, please take care of this planet. Only you can. Uh, it is almost on a roller coaster ride towards, you know, complete destruction. You can stop it. You can pause it. And please do it because your life depends on it.